All right, go for it. Thank you all so much for coming out tonight. As someone who spent the past 10 plus years with the man that you see before you, I can attest that he certainly does have his monstrous moments, mostly in the morning before he has had his cup of coffee. <laughs> but Cain is a good man with a good heart, and everything that he does is with the very best of intentions. As an FBI agent, I see a lot of truly awful and disturbing things. And I'm really lucky to have a man like Kane to come home to at night. When he first approached me about using my cases as a basis for his films, I was naturally hesitant at first. But then after giving it a lot of thought, I realized there was nobody better than Kane. He will make sure that the innocent victims are never forgotten. Thank you all so much. What are you, what are you working on? What? Nothing, why? I don't know, you, you seem a little more interested in us and a little bit less interested in your work. I don't know, feeling uh, wanted. It's just the cases. Can't you just like, leave work behind just for one night, please? It's, it's the Wilson case. It fucking bugs me. Solved. Suicide, right? A uh, suicide note was found. Bryce, is she, uh, is she slipping? Can you, you gotta be kidding me, right? Not tonight. You, why are you so fucking pushy? Pushy? Me? Look, I'm trying to relax. I'm, I'm trying to, to kiss you. And I, I'm, I'm pushy? God, nice! Just thanks! I'm, I'm sorry. Look, just don't forget it's important for you as well. You know, I should be able to enjoy my wife for one night without work being involved. Cases, I swear to God, I, I just I need a drink. Enjoy me? You? Fuck me for two minutes and then come? <laughs> Classic came. Fucking bitch, I swear to God. You're so fucking bitch. Remember that there? Oh. Yeah, you know what? I never heard you complain before. You haven't satisfied me in years. Go get me that drink, Kane. Bitch! Poor you. Shirt on and you're walking away. <laughs> Gave up so fast. Keep pushing me. Keep pushing me. Classic. Walk away. Just like you always do. Let's do it again. One more time, yeah. What are you what are you working on? What? Nothing, why? Uh, you just seem a little, uh, like a little more interested in us and maybe a little bit less interested in your work. Uh, I don't know. It's just feeling unwanted, you know? It's just cases. Okay. <laughs> Can't you just leave work behind just for tonight? It's the Wilson case. It's fucking bugging me. It's suicide solved, right? A suicide note was found. Hey, Bryce, you think she's, uh, think she's slipping a little bit? You've got to be kidding me, right, Kane? Not tonight. Why are you being so fucking pushy? Pushy! Me! Trying to relax you? Trying to kiss you? I'm pushy! Nice! Fucking thanks! I'm, just, look, I'm sorry. Just don't forget it's important to you as well. You know, I should be able to enjoy my wife without any bullshit work around! God, do it! I need a freaking drink! Enjoy me? You? Fuck me for two minutes and then come? Classic Kane. You know, I never heard you complaining before. You haven't satisfied me in years. Go get me that drink, Kane. You're such a fucking bitch! Don't you dare talk to me that way! Be a man, Kane. Don't you know how to handle a woman? Classic.
Walk away, just like you always do. That's way better. I think so too. <laughs> Uh, I need to, uh, I need to run into town this morning and grab a few things. Do you anything? No, thank you. I'm all right. Hey, Kane? Yeah. I'm sorry about last night. Don't worry about it. You know, whatever. It's already forgotten and, uh, I'll be back later. A brutally mutilated corpse of a female and her killer, Buddy Broxton, were found in Santa Fe, New Mexico. Her killer was never found and it got documented as an unexplained murder. There's no mention of a symbol carved into his torso. Why? This should have been documented. It could link us to his killer. Double-headed snake. Aztec religion means rebirth. The cross represents the death of Christ to obtain eternal life. And the nine-pointed star is Baha's faith, spiritual unity of mankind. Some interesting facts. So, uh, look, I, I need to run into town this morning and um, uh, go grab a few things. You want know anything? No, no, thank you. Um, okay. Hey, Kane? Yep. I'm sorry about last night. You know what? Don't worry about it. All right? Sorry you forgot. I'll uh, be back later, okay? In 1995, a brutally mutilated corpse of a female and her killer, Buddy Broxton, were found in Santa Fe, New Mexico. His killer was never found and it got documented as an unexplained murder. There's no mention of the symbol carved into his torso. But why? This should have been documented. It could link us to his killer. Double-headed snake, Aztec religion, means rebirth. Cross represents the death of Christ to obtain eternal life. The nine-pointed star represents Baha's faith, spiritual unity of mankind. Interesting facts. Recording. The Delphic Sibyl was a legendary figure who made prophecies in the sacred precinct of Apollo at Adelphi, on the slopes of Mount Parnassus. According to a late source, her mother was Lamia, daughter of Poseidon. Note to self, another serial killer with an obsession with history. Delphic Sibyl, born between a man and a goddess, daughter of sea monsters and an immortal nymph. Self, try to figure out why her killer is obsessed with. Okay, action. The Delphic Sibyl was a legendary figure whose prophecies made. Can I start over? Yeah. Okay. The Delphic Sibyl was a legendary figure who made prophecies in the sacred precinct of Apollo at Delphi, on the slopes of Mar Mount Parnassus. According to a late source, her mother was Lamia, daughter of Poseidon. Note to self, another serial killer with an obsession with history. Delphic Sybil, born between a man and a goddess, daughter of sea monsters and an immortal nymph. Note to self, I must try to figure out why another killer is obsessed with. I'm gonna be working late anyway, so. Oh, uh, what's it about? Oh, please. Marianne, you know what I mean? It's, it's really not necessary. You got zero interest anyway. Zero interest, Kane? 
What's not necessary? Me faking my interest? Well, you know, I do love your zero interest in me, and faking has sort of been part of our marriage. I don't know, whatever. It's just, it's just, this, this seems more of like a, like a, like a business partnership, okay? And, and you know what's right, Marianne, okay? So why don't we just, why don't we just, why don't we just play nice, okay? You know that's not true, but a business partnership? Isn't that taking it a little too far? Yes, it's it's far, okay? And it feels like a sort of a, a power trip between us. Our power trips and constant struggles between us makes us who we are. We have an agreement, Kane. I let you look at my files and you make them into movies. Seems like a perfect partnership. Too bad our marriage isn't the perfect partnership. Corporate merger between FBI agent and filmmaker, okay? They both try to figure out how it ends. In your end, they die. In my end, they're acting. Okay, well, let's act like this never happened. I'm off to bed. Whatever. I'm not for a walk. Sweet dreams, dear. Love you. You want me to Okay. Yeah, that was nice, though. Yeah. Okay. okay. So cool. I can't stand it. Can't say what? My eyes. I used to, my eyes used to be so bad. I could never see beyond this. And then I had the laser eye surgery. And then as I got hit in like 30, 40, it's like it's starting to get blurry again. Yeah, mine's kind of getting blurry. Yeah. It's not good. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm going to be going to bed early tonight. Okay. I'm working anyway. Thank you. Oh, um, well, what's it about? <laughs> oh, please. Seriously, Marianne, I mean, it's really not necessary. I know you have zero interest in me, okay? Zero interest, Kane? And what's not necessary? Me faking my interest? Yeah, you faking, but I love your zero interest, okay? I love your zero interest in me, and faking is, seems to be part of our marriage. So this is more, I don't know, like, like a freaking uh, business partnership. And uh, you know what's right, Grand? Okay, so let's just, let's just play nice, okay? Uh, you know that's not true, but a business partnership? I mean... Isn't that taking it a little far? Yes, it's far. Feels like an endless power trip to me. Our endless power trips and partnership is what makes us who we are. We have an agreement. I let you look at my cases and you make movies, Kane. It seems like the perfect partnership. Too bad our marriage isn't like a perfect partnership. Yeah, there. You know, corporate merger between the freaking FBI agent and the filmmaker. Whatever. In freaking your case, you know, they're, they're gonna die! In my case, they're acting. Okay, well let's act like this never happened. I'm off to bed. Whatever, I'm out for a walk. Sweet dreams, dear. Love you. I'm gonna do it like I'm walking out okay. for you. Kane? Kane? <laughs> Tonight, <laughs> we make you a star. <laughs> Kane, you're drunk. Get, get to bed and get some rest. Oh, you're so beautiful. Kane, I, oh, I, don't, I don't feel so good. Don't you worry. I always take care of my stars. You're the 